Hi, my name is Rick, and I just want to bring to the attention a lot of people that these uh, USB flash drives that are being marketed on eBay, a lot of them are fake. Um, you know the old saying, if it's uh, you know, too good to be true, then there's probably something wrong with it. Well, that was it. These were marketed on eBay, 16 gigabyte drives for roughly around $15, comes out to about a dollar a gigabyte is norm but some of these are going for up to thirty dollars for reputable manufacturers well this actual ebay uh, seller marketed these as brand new and they were in the package and i told them beforehand that i was going to run a software checker against these to um, make sure that they're actually able to handle 16 gigabyte Sometimes you don't care whether the manufacturer's name was actually the manufacturer, as long as you can have 16 gigabyte of storage. I know from a manufacturer's standpoint, that's not a good thing that somebody's copying their product. These are definitely copies. I can't give out the eBay seller's name because PayPal and eBay are um, involved uh, with an investigation, and I'm not allowed to do that, but I'm just going to make everybody aware of uh, maybe what to do what to look for and not get stung by these things anyway I got it they do look good they come in a package everything looks good they look like normal things except if you really did some investigation if you look at the particular serial number that's on these things you go to Transend's uh, website they didn't make a 16 gigabyte in this particular um, drive uh, model uh, they stopped at 8 so that should have been a red flag. I didn't investigate that further than you know when I, I actually purchased them. Um, what I did is I used a software called H2 Test W. And what that'll do, it's real simple. I'm going to try to bring the software up for you so you can see it. It's actually made in German, but it has an English tab. You click on that and you insert your drive into your USB port, click select target, and it'll do a scan and it'll tell you whether it's a good drive or it's defective. Of course, I don't know if you can see that. It says this media is likely to be defective. There was only 1.9 gigabyte OK and 13.6 gigabytes were lost. So what they've done is they've taken roughly a two gigabyte drive and they've um, scanned it and they've imprinted that information on um, it actually you know onto a regular two gigabyte and they've actually scanned the 16 gigabyte information in there so when you plug it in you think you got 16 gigabytes of hard drive or uh, storage space and you don't a um, couple different things there are different programs there's another one that's actually called um, Flash drive card tester, it's version 1.14, it's by vconsole.com, and hopefully you can see that. I just have a, a small camera here. You can download that, that'll actually do the same thing, it'll tell you if there's anything wrong with it, um, and then you can, uh, you know, check your adapter. Other things you can do is to really check it out is if you have large movie files stored on your computer like a four gigabyte or something like that I would recommend um, trying to upload that to this adapter uh, when it's done if it doesn't fail on error because it um, didn't have enough storage for your particular files you know of course 16 gigabytes is large and you're only throwing four in there and it's failing you know you got a problem a lot of times it'll show that it did go on there and then you go back and you try to review those files uh, depending on how many movies you have on there, some may play and some are going to say that they're not found and, you know, your computer is going to say, well, want me to try to repair them. You try to repair them. They're not going to be there. They're corrupted because the whole file has not transferred. They're pretty slick with these things. So I hope that helps out and um, maybe uh, someone else won't get stung and I'm going to leave this on um, YouTube for everybody to take a look at. Um, you can leave some comments and... Um, Hopefully it will help everybody. Thank you very much. Bye.